January 12, 2018 Have you ever been alone with God? 1. When they were alone, he explained all things to his disciples. Mark 4.34 Our solitude with him. Jesus doesn't take us aside and explain things to us all the time, he explains things to us as we are able to understand them. The lives of others are examples for us, but God requires us to examine our own souls. It is slow work so slow that it takes God all of time and eternity to make a man or woman conform to his purpose. We can only be used by God after we allow him to show us the deep, hidden areas of our own character. It is astounding how ignorant we are about ourselves. We don't even recognize the envy, laziness, or pride within us when we see it. But Jesus will reveal to us everything we have held within ourselves before his grace began to work. How many of us have learned to look inwardly with courage? We have to get rid of the idea that we understand ourselves. That is always the last bit of pride to go. The only one who understands us is God. The greatest curse in our spiritual life is pride. If we have ever had a glimpse of what we are like in the sight of God, we will never say, Oh, I'm so unworthy. We will understand that this goes without saying. But as long as there is any doubt that we are unworthy, God will continue to close us in until he gets us alone. Whenever there is any element of pride or conceit remaining, Jesus can't teach us anything. He will allow us to experience heartbreak or the disappointment we feel when our intellectual pride is wounded. He will reveal numerous misplaced affections or desires things over which we never thought he would have to get us alone. Many things are shown to us, often without effect. But when God gets us alone over them, they will be clear.